Send button. Hi, hello, namaste. This is Rama Rao. You are watching Rama Rao Damaraju YouTube channel. Please do subscribe my channel, like, comment, and share. Friends, with the help of Humanity Organization, I am giving information regarding groups in my channel. I thank Humanity Organization for giving me this opportunity to post these kind of videos in my channel. Thank you so much. If I talk about Humanity Organization, they are working for visual impaired persons. They are doing in 13 countries across the world. They are providing scribes for visual impaired. They are giving audio materials. They are giving study materials. They can provide you at in any language like English, Telugu, Tamil, Malayalam, etc. With free of cost. They are not even expecting single paisa. So friends, Encourage Humanity Organization and also my channel. Do subscribe my channel, like, comment, share. Thank you. Send. Chapter 3 Our Changing Earth This page has a short note with the heading Activity Reading Take a small colored paper pellet and put it in a beaker half filled with water Place the beaker on a tripod stand and heat it as the water warms up you will observe that the paper pellet is moving upward along with at the bottom of this note there is a picture of the seismograph it looks like a big pipeline with some equipment second question tick the correct answer this section has five questions each of which has three options. So we have to choose the correct one. Question one, which is not an erosional feature of sea waves? A. Cliff B. Beach C. Sea cave 2. The depositional feature of a glacier is A. Flood plain B. Beach C. Moraine Question 3 Which is caused by the sudden movements of the earth? A. Volcano B. Folding C. Flood plain Question 4 Mushroom rocks are found in A. Deserts B. River valleys C. Glaciers Fifth question Oxbow lakes are found in A. Glaciers B. River valleys C. Deserts Now we move to the next question number 3 It is much the following type question In the first row six items are given and in the second row eight items are given okay in first row first item glacier second item meanders third item beach fourth item sand dunes fifth item 
waterfall. Sixth item, earthquake. In the second row, A, seashore, B, mushroom rock, C, river of ice, D, rivers, E, vibrations of earth, F, sea cliff, G, hard bed rock, H, deserts. Fourth question, give reasons for the following. This has four statements. First one, some rocks have a shape of a mushroom. Second one, flood plains are very fertile. Third one, sea caves are turned into stacks. Fourth one, buildings collapse due to earthquakes. The fifth question is activity based and the question reads, observe the photographs given below. These are various features made by a river. Identify them and also tell whether they are erosional or depositional or landforms formed by both. This has three photos arranged one below the other and there are two columns. The first column to describe to name the feature. The second column to mention the type whether erosional or depositional or both. The first photo it is like the picture we have already seen of Niagara Falls. Water flowing from a great height and at the bottom because of the force water looks like a heap of cotton. Then the second picture looks like it is taken from the top of a mountain. It shows down below the course of a river which is flanked by a thick vegetation. The last picture is that of a large field clearly marked as compartments. It is very greenish and at the far end we see a sloping mountain which has thick trees grown without any gap. It is so dense. Then sixth question for fun. It is actually a crossword puzzle. It has horizontal as well as vertical bars with individual blocks for writing the answer using alphabets. So the bars are not in any fixed shape. It changes. The bars are such that even in one bar at the end or somewhere in the middle there is a connection to another bar which means from that point from the letter you have to write there another word as an answer could be filled up. It is like that. Now the clues given for across bars and vertical or down bars or like this across bars the number I now read out with the description relate to the location of the starting point of the word to loop like the bend of a river for solid form of water seven moving mass of ice nine sudden descent of water in the bed of a river eleven natural cavity on weak rocks 
formed by action of waves. 12. Embankment on a river that keeps it in its channel. 13. Large body of sea water. 14. Dry area where sand dunes are found. 15. Small hill of sand caused by the action of the wind. 16. Flat plain formed by river deposits during time of flood. Then, for the down or vertical bars, the clues given are numbered like this. 1. Rise and fall of water caused by friction of wind on water surface. 3. Flow of water in a channel. 5. Steep perpendicular face of a rock along a sea coast. 6. Debris. D-E-B-R-I-S. Pronounced as debris of boulder. B-O-U-L-D-E-R. And coarse. C-O-A-R-S-E. Coarse material carried by glacier. 8. Crescent. C-R-E-S-C-E-N-T. Crescent shaped leg formed by a meandering river. 10. Fine sand deposited by the action of the wind. 13. Isolated mass of rising steep rock near a coastline. 14. Alluvial. A L L U V I A L. Alluvial tracts of land formed by the river deposits at the mouth of your river. With this, this chapter ends.